Division of South African football is known as the ABC Motsepe League and for many it's the feeder into the upper echelons of South African football. But Gauteng's log leaders in the league, Baberua FC, have a vision of their own for the club and its players. Chairman Joe Sionejo and the 2014-2015 PSL Player of the Year defender Tefu Mashamaite, who has recently just signed with Baberua FC, join me now. Good morning to the both of you and welcome to the show. Morning. Morning. Okay, so um, Joe, I just want to start with you. Uh, tell us about this name and tell us a little bit more about this club because it was only uh, founded four years ago. You guys are based in Midrand? Yeah, we are based in Midrand, but the Baviroa name is from the, the village called uh, Sukmekar. So that is where we're getting the name from. And also its popularity in <coughs> the area called Bochum. And yeah, so that is how the name came from. Okay, and you guys are looking for promotion to the National First Division? Yeah, we're looking for promotion because at our first season, you look at the players who are really now trading their, their, their career in PSL. Like one of our guys, he just lifted the, the, the Telkom Cup, which is, he was the captain. Udududum Tansan is from Bavira FC, if you don't know. Okay. And then Matumu Khechani, and then also Matumu Maveva, they are from also Bavira FC. So now we're looking to promote the team, not the players only. Okay, I yeah. see. Uh, Tefu, tell us what happened. After winning the award and it looked as if the world was your oyster, going to Sweden and now you're playing in the third division, many people were saying, where are you, where are you, where are you? Tell us a little bit how the last three years have been for you. Yeah, well, I just uh, decided to just engage my, my own world, um, have my own experience. Went to Sweden, came back, joined Supersport, played in the Confed Cup final. Now I'm back with Bavira. I'm trying to just contribute back to just the f uh, football in South Africa. Okay, and why this team? Uh, because firstly, it's from Limpopo, and we are looking for a promotion. And I'm 34. I'm looking to just uh, give back. Um, I've had like a, you know a career where I, I was successful, played in the PSL, and like right now I'm just trying to wind down and you know just give back, like I said. Okay, so you're not looking to play at the club and then get uh, another signing maybe or take this club even to the PSL? I mean, that, that's the plan right now. But like, you know, um, situations change. And at this age, um, I'm looking to just inspire the youngsters with my experience on the field. And you never know what happens in two years' time. Maybe Brajo will give me something in the <laughs> administration and I'll be uh, willing to take that. Uh, Joe... This is a club of second chances. Uh, you guys are looking at even signing Lerata Chibangu. Um, tell us a little bit about your vision for this team because it's not only these young stars that are maybe getting the footballing platform, like you mentioned, uh, with uh, one of those youngsters lifting the Nedbank Cup uh, recently with Baraka, but this is also a team that's taking ex-players. Uh, I know uh, Itumile Nkune's brother is also with you guys. Yes, the, the vision of the team is, 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 is quite simple. Um, we're looking to balance the, 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 the equation from both sides. So we're taking the experience, which is they will educate the youngsters how football has been played and how also to, you have to behave. So like if you take the guy like, like Masha Maiti, Itumilin Kuni, younger brother like Kuni, Kotagwag Masugu, and then you groom the youngsters based on, on, on those uh, experience. It's going to be quite easy for me. And then after that, these guys, their task is simple, is to promote the team to NFT, which is very quite challenging. And then from there, we'll take another step to promote the team to, 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 to PSL. Because we look at the, our support base, we already got a lot of branches. We've got branches in Tembis, we've got branches in LX, we've got a new branch, which is just formed in, at Oliven also. In Limpopo, we have more popularity. In Cape Town, there's also branch also from there in Cape Town. So we're looking to venture into all these provinces. So we, we come with a different dimension as an uh, APC team with the League. So that when we prepare ourselves to go to NFT, we know that the stadium must be full. We must bring people back to the stadium. Is it your idea that you get these ex PSL players, these big names and a couple of the youngsters that are really talented and you take them all the way to the PSL over the next uh, two, three seasons? Yeah, look, if, if, the, is, if we got promoted to NFT, because what we wanted to do, we want to form the, 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 the development structure within Baviro, whereby we'll develop players from eight years up to 20 years, so that when you go to be able to play at the PSL, 
it's going to be quite simple for us because we can <coughs> nature the, 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 the players from, from, from our development structure. But for the ex-players, what we wanted to do, we want them to grow with the team, to know the culture of the team, so that when we, when we are at higher level, we don't need to go somewhere saying that I'm looking for a coach or I'm looking for, for, for somebody who can run, run my development team or I'm looking for administrator. Look, if you take like the guy like Tefo, you make him in PR. You say, okay, this is your position. He knows all about football. He's been playing for Chiefs. He played for, for Wave. He played for, for Supersport. He also played at Sweden. And then, hence on, if we form our, 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 our thing in the club saying that, okay, now I want to take the players to, 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 to overseas. Who are the guys who are going to do the job? These guys, they need to do that job. So that okay. they're not going to be on the street saying that I'm looking for the job or I'm looking to venture into something else. They already created their own, their own, 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 own environment whereby they're going to be easy to work on that one. Masha, how do you feel about the energy within the team and what the possibilities are for the team over the next three years? I mean, it's a, it's a new beginning. Uh, it's like a child that needs to be nurtured. And like, I'm just excited to be part of this, especially at the stage where it is, you know, um, needing to grow with it and just see it like just developing and becoming uh, something big. So it's inspiring. I mean, we don't always have to jump on the bandwagon. Sometimes you just have to go down and create your own. And that's what I'm looking at. You're wanting to create your own opportunities and create a different legacy and pathway for yourself? Definitely, because it's, it's easy to, to jump on the moving train, you know. Um, but like if you have to go down to the grassroots and just like, like I said, see the baby grow. I mean, that's the most uh, fulfilling thing. All right, so Tefo Mashamita is wanting to become a father uh, and watch his baby in Vibero <laughs> FC grow along with Joe. Uh, they're doing a joint father parenting uh, plan. Thank you very much to the both of you. All the best of luck uh, to Vibero and uh, to the future and uh, some of those players that you're hoping, on, uh, hoping to sign on to the team. Okay, thank, thank you. Thank you very much. Uh, that's chairman of Beberwa FC, Josie Anejo, as well as Tefo Mashamaita, uh, former Kaiser Chiefs. Uh, Bidvestwitz and uh, Supersport United. Okay, that's how we come to the end of your sport.